Look, I don't care. I just want to know their names. Who, Cope? One of them is a man named Randall. Been with the camp almost a year. I didn't know the other two. You want me to hmm. ask? No, I guess not. You find that son of a bitch. You radio me. Copeland out. That's it. All right. Where? You're mine now. There he is! Silver helmet. Red gas tank. That's him. Oh, shit! The hell? So you thought you'd ride into Copeland's camp, shoot the place up, that about right? Kill a few folks, take some shit, and just ride out like you just... ...no choppy in the wall. Screw you, Drifter! You working for Copeland? Yeah! Myself, if you want to know the truth, give Drifters a bad name. What if you'd shot Manny? You know, who fixed my bike then? Stupid piece of shit. <laughs> Screw you! You are Copeland's toadies! You little bitch! That's what you are! You little bitch! Cope, it's done. I got him. Mark down these coordinates and send your man out of here. Is he alive? Yeah, he's alive. But I won't promise you how long he's gonna stay that way. Deacon out. St. John, stop by the hot springs when you can. Tucker, I hear you. St. John out. Aren't you in your damn bunk? I couldn't sleep. You, you remember what I said? 
back in the tunnel. Don't go up there, Dick. It's it's making you crazy. Who's her? I, okay, look. I go up there because there's freaks up there. I kill them here, I kill them there. Bounties are all the same to me. Then what are the tulips for, huh? I saw them. Here on the table. This morning. The same one she had at the wedding. I remember. Fucking up. Listen, loser. Get some rest. I gotta go. Deacon out. Tulips, Boozer, the stone cop. Get it right. Okay, one nest done. How many more you got? Boozer, you there? I was just calling to check up on you. Hang in there, buddy. As soon as we get that arm patched up, we'll ride north, just like you said. We just work on getting better. I still got some work to do on the bike, and we gotta stock up on some gear. But once you're patched up, we're out of here. Deacon out. Yeah. Come on, fellas. for the camp. I just wanted to say thank you. all of them in here. Sons of bitches, come on! Yeah. 
sleeping. Don't pay no attention to me. This should be less freezing them out. Some shut eye boozer. Deacon out. Hey, man. Hey, just taking a look. I got you covered. Later. Yeah? Deke, you ever ride with a drifter, scars all over his face, carries a tire iron, goes by the name of Limbo? Don't know him. He came into camp yesterday to turn in some bounties, have a few drinks. Seems like he didn't leave until early this morning. Well, Tuck, I don't run security here, so why don't you just tell Alki about that? He beat a man, Deke, and a woman, to death, Bowman and Hewitt. Her face was so smashed in, you couldn't tell it was her. Hewitt, oh, Maria, right? Jesus. This asshole, Limbo, he's a local. Alki says they've set up shop at the old Forest Service watchtower on the east slope of Three Finger Jack. Yep, I know where it is, and, uh... I'll handle it. I thought you might. How you doing? What? Hey, what's going on? What else can I do for you? Can I get anything else for you? Here you go. Yeah, I can upgrade that. Find me if you need anything else. Later. You here for your bike? Hey, what's up?
Just a sec. Gotta open the gate. Infestation zone. Right, we used to protect ourselves, our families, our property. That is, until the ever growing federal government got scared of the people they swore to protect. Over the years, they stripped us of every gun that they could. A few mass shootings as an excuse to curtail the God given rights of us, American citizens. Gun control. And there, with the sickness yes. that ladies and gentlemen. Gotta be right Let around here. This. When all this shit went down, ah. if every American was back in the do you think we'd be in this mess? But this is how the feds wanted it. Disarming the public is just the first step to work in of us all. So who knows those gun laws really protect? Sure as hell wasn't us, the American taxpayers. Someday, we have a ticket out of this. I wanna take a poll. I bet those who survived were those who had guns. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Okay, Cope, this time you got me. I'll take all the guns. <laughs> Jesus, something went down. Wonder if the poor bastards had anything worth looking for. I smell it. <clears throat> it's gotta be getting close. Let him in. How's it going? What are you doing? Your bike could use some work. Ah, I rode this one hard. See you later. You need what? something? Can I get anything else for you? Good choice. Good piece. Should help out in the shit. I'll let Tucker know you stopped by. You here for your bike? Hey, just taking a look.
Let me get the gate. How's it going? I never did finish burning out this nesting zone. Hey, 
Me again. Deacon, I gotta tell you something. I, it's okay, it's just my nerve. You told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you. I mean, I knew that it was getting worse, but I... None of us knew it was gonna go away like this. It's fast. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey. I'm not losing anyone. I made a promise. Remember? Deacon, wait! Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. Wait. Hey. Hey, are you okay? Come on, we gotta find your parents, okay? Hey, come on. Stabbed me. Um, I don't know. I don't. I don't think it's that bad. Okay, okay. Just hold this here as long as you can. I don't think so. I think I can walk. Okay, good enough. Okay. Two hours ago, this place was calling the feds. Yeah, they must have evacuated. Yeah, 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 they must have bugged out. Yeah, she's burning up. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning sick. Mm. How you doing, little sister? So stupid. This this little... This little kid. This... This goddamn little kid. Big goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Mm. Oh, oh, shit. Mm. Hey, Mom. You want to be able to come through? We gotta get to the roof. Flag down one of those choppers. All right. Mm. Yeah, see if you can rest over here. Hey. Mm. Easy, easy. <sighs> Much my little sister, you know. Mm. So we used to play that hide and seek game all the time. And she would just, just uh, hide her head in her coat, just like that. Mm. I've been cutting my name, but nothing like that. She's burning up. Jesus. Okay. We gotta move. We're going that way. Uh, come on. Hey, sweetheart, can you move? Right, what's your hand? Yeah, I got her. Go find this way out. Listen to me. My girl's out there. She's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out there's here. a helicopter. You killed her. So listen. You killed just... my wife. Oh no no no! Look, I, I didn't know anything about your wife being killed. I'm sorry, sir. Do anything. 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 Do She's been wounded. What's wrong with her? Well, she's not. Whatever the hell's going on out there, she's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay. Listen, O'Brien. If we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. Oh, come on. No more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteers for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. Okay. I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. Why you got room for two of you? We're over weight, okay? I can only take two of you. Two. 
Come on, help me, come on. All right, sweetheart. It's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. Loser. Let's go. We gotta get on that guy. We gotta get on that shot. I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Look, I've been through worse shit than this before. You know? Here we go. Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer is never gonna make it without me. I want this back. You coming? I'll be back. Boozer? Another Nero chopper. I wonder what the hell they're up to. <laughs> 